Hello guys and welcome back to Rust. I say Rust because it's not actually ex experimental anymore, this is actually the current version of Rust. If you do want to play the older version then when you start up you have to play Legacy, but now this is just Rust. So here we are in our cabin, it's not, it isn't the one from before, I've had to start again and make a new one. But here we go, I'm going to show you how to upgrade today and you know last time I said about well I don't quite know why he's got green walls, well that is because he's upgraded them. Now it goes wood, stone and then metal, of course metal you need metal, fragment stone you need stone and wood, well it's really easy to get so you just need wood. Now how do you upgrade? Well you just do this and as you can see it takes it off of me and then it does that. Now you can see that yeah, one thing I like is it actually tells you how much um, food you and well I'm guessing water you've got right now. Not quite sure what water is since you you just get it from food and I say actually let's check our food. Oops. And I've hurt myself. Great. Open fire. Have we cooked? Oops. Well we should probably check on these more often now. Come on. I'll probably have to extinguish it. That's one thing I still find a little bit annoying. Come on. Open fire. There we go. Now I wonder if I can actually eat the burnt meat. Ignite fire. We've just got um, a load of metal going in here. Lovely. Uh, let's see. One thing I find a bit weird is that eating meat, you have to right click it and eat instead of putting it in your bar. Oh, I can't actually use that. Let's just drop that and be left here. So I'm... For upgrading, I'm not actually quite sure how many like wood and things you need for I think it could be literally just like 10 or something and then each time it upgrades it just takes longer to actually go. Is this... Wait, I've already upgraded this stone? Is it... Has this actually got a model? Huh. Not quite sure. Also... No, is, is that max upgraded? Guys, this is weird. Anyway, so let's open here. No, no, let's just lock it again. Whoa! Get out of here! Get out of here! Get out! Get out! Stupid man. Let's take his meat. Any loot? Eh, not really anything good. Come on, get out, get out. I don't want to die. So it looks like we have to upgrade. <laughs> God, that was a bit... <sighs> Got my blood pumping then. <laughs> okay, so let's upgrade our wall then. There we go. It's fixed straight away. I don't think he actually got anything, which is good. Very, very good. But let's upgrade this wall since this is for one, like... All the way, uh, against the uh, outdoors, so let's upgrade this one. Ugh, God, I'm stuck now, aren't I? Let's burn ourselves a little bit because why not? God. I don't like people <laughs> trying to steal my stuff. Upgraded. So this, of course, just makes them stronger. Where before you had to know, like, find a blueprint for like a metal door and then use that, and then like you had to, if you wanted to get through it, you needed like explosives or something. But it seems like you can actually get through walls very fast now. I didn't realise it took that. Well, it was that um, short amount of time. Now, what I wanted to. We'll upgrade the wall, just the walls against here before we actually go out. What I wanted to tell you is, now of course you get stone which is the worst for gathering things and then it goes up to stone hatchet and then hatchet. Is that upgrading? Yes it is, level 2. And then like stone uh, pickaxe and stuff. Now they of course do better but one thing I've noticed is actually the best tool to harvest stuff is the bone knife. It's. I'm not quite sure of the logic with that. Um, come on, upgrade. 
see, uh, I'm kind of annoyed that you can't see it on the doors. That's been upgraded. This hasn't. It would also be nice to be able to, like, if you hit it, it just says level 2 or something. So that you actually know. So that's been up level 2. All up level 2. Let's do the ceiling now, and then I'll go out and show you the bone knife. I'm playing on the island server because it's like. It, it's the official. Um, Rust server, and well, I didn't want to really go on a custom server. Even though we actually had better ping, which I'm surprised, but I guess like a server with 20 ping with no people versus a server with 50 ping and 40 ping. 50 people and 40 ping. Kind of makes sense. God, it looks like my house is on fire. God, I really hope you can't set a house on fire. <laughs> uh, did this upgrade or level 2? There we go. Oh, you can also upgrade the foundation, and that was actually a sneaky way I uh, played before. I found out that, oh look, a guy just built his house up to like the highest thing. Oh, he's forgotten to upgrade his foundation. So what you can do is upgrade, um, like, like just destroy the foundation, walk underneath the wall, and jump up into it. It's, it's so cheaty, <laughs> but it's, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> kind of funny. One thing I'd wish they'd add is like windows because I don't actually think there are windows yet. No, because it's a window plan, and that's it. I guess I could put a um. Oh, I hate doing this. Uh, let's just do floor plan. We don't want that. I could put like a barrier in front of it, but then that means I've just got a barrier in front of it. I, I won't be able to open my window and have a beautiful view outside. But at least you can't just jump through the uh, windows. You probably wonder what bees are. That's a well, burnt wolf meat, and that's a wooden key. That isn't the wooden key to this house, so yeah. <laughs> I just kind of find it, found it on the um, way to actually coming here. Now, one thing which is a must where before I was like eh I don't really need it I'll I'll just make um fuel and uh clothing first is a sleeping bag that is an absolute must now because of course people kill you which is great very very great let's loot all of this out yep thank you very much and I just realized I uh, yep our meat is burnt I completely forgot about it. Extinguish. Nope. Extinguish. Open fire. <sighs> I'm really bad at cooking, as you can probably tell. Actually, open again. Put that in. Put that in. We haven't got much meat, so we need it. We've got human meat, which is cool. Uh, let's just chuck that. Drop. Drop. One way I would like to do it is be able to like drag it off and drop it. Uh, we shall make a hatchet. Yes. Or if we go out and unlock, open door. I actually put the door in the correct way this time. Lucky me. <laughs> uh, what I want to show you. So we need to find like a tree. Where is the closest tree? Is that a tree or is that a bush? I think it's just a bush, but we should still go over here just to make sure. Ah, here's some uh, metal ore, I think. Or is that... No, I think this is metal. I was going to say sapphire then, but it's not sapphire. So this is a stone. This gives you 24 stones per hit. This is a hatchet. It gives you 32 uh, per hit. This is the bone knife. 80. Yes. 80. And I'm guessing the hatchet will give you like 40 or something. And then stone uh, pickaxe will give you... Closer to 80 or something, probably 100 actually, but this is very, very cheap because all you need is bone fragments and you get that from killing players, killing animals, just binding them because a lot of people actually just get rid of them, which is great for me. Come on, I should really have like a, yeah, let's do it now. Uh, triangle, triangle, floor triangle, can I do it here? Whoops. No, I cannot. I could probably make a foundation. Oh, foundation steps. Oh, that's cool. Uh, foundation triangle. Oh, no. Foundation triangle. Am I just 
being stupid or is this not working? Lock. Found. Wait, where is the foundation? What? Found it. Oh, it's right there. There, that's what I wanted. Oh, I can't place it there. Oh. <laughs> okay then. Yeah. Well, that's a bit annoying. I have to, like, jump every time I... Ugh, come on. Come on. Up we go. Done. And lock. We shall make a... What is it? It's a light. Where's the light? Because I want a light. Or should we make a helmet? Because we didn't have a helmet before. Oh, wait. Bucket helmet. Ooh. Uh, coffee can helmet. What else is there? There's metal face mask. I don't actually know. Oh, we could make this. That will go with our outfit. There we go. We'll make a hazmat one. <laughs> uh, what did I want to do? What did I want to do? Well, I've got my uh, hatchet now, so let's get rid of that stone one and place you there. Oh yes, I wanted to make a lantern. Let's put more wood in here. I know I'm putting it all in, but we don't really care. Ignite. Oh god, is our meter getting extinguished? Open. Ah, oh, again, burnt meat. I really suck at this. This time, I'm going to stay in it and open fire. Let's cook some raw human meat, shall we? Since i got a load of that. There we go. Let's chuck our raw... Uh, drop meat there. Uh, drop. And again. Uh, hazmat helmet. Come on, give us a helmet. We want a helmet. Come on. So this one seems like it actually has a backpack thing as well. I uh, want to attach you... <laughs> what? What? That's nothing like that. Oh, I guess it is, because that's the neck. I thought that was like a little hat. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> um, open fire. You cooked yet? I'm not even sure if you can uh, cook it. But should I eat it? Yeah, let's eat it. I wonder if we can just eat it. Oh, we can. We can eat human meat. I'm guessing it does, yeah, health. Oh. Oh, oh no. Does it stop going down? Am I going to have to make a um, bandage or something? Has this... I think it stopped now. Oh, okay. Good. Uh, open fire. Raw human meat. We should probably get more uh, ovens up and going. Uh, open furnace. How many have we got there? Thank you. Take them. Take. I guess I can't. Still can't take out that one. Still raw. Come on. Uh, open furnace. No, no. I'll just leave that there for now. Open fire. Come on. Cook. Cook. Guess we can hammer a few things here. Oh no! I got all rid of all of my wood in there, didn't I? Ah. I guess I can't upgrade. Uh, open fire. Come on. If we get this, then I'll be able to go out. God, why isn't this cooking? I think I may, just may not be able to cook it. Extinguish fire. Ignite fire. Open fire. Cooked yet? Yes! Extinguish. Open. Cooked human meat. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Uh, we'll leave that in there. Wait, did that do? No, it didn't. Hmm, I guess we should cook the other meat whilst we're here. There we go. There we go. Did I actually put it in? Yes, I did. Ignite. Now we can eat cooked meat. Eat human meat. Awesome and awesome. It doesn't do much for our water. I'm not... But I don't think it is actually any water bucket kind of thing that you can have yet anyway. So that's a bit annoying. Uh, lantern. 50 metal fragments. Uh, open. Come on. Still a little bit awkward to actually take stuff out. Uh, what else do we need? We need low-grade fuel. 15. Uh, 
And that's in here. Two of those. They're like really fast ones. Awesome. Uh, lantern. Will I actually have a lantern? Oh, really? So slow. So, so slow. Open fire. Wow, that's a bit weird. Didn't open it properly then. Hmm. I guess we could upgrade some of the walls now. In fact, let's upgrade the door. And of course, I don't have wood, so I guess I can't upgrade the wall. The door. Uh, open fire. Still war. Come on, lantern. We need you. We need you, lantern. I'm trying to upgrade a wall which is in the light so you can actually see it. But of course, we don't have a lantern yet, so we can't see it all. I really shouldn't have put that thing there, because that's just so annoying. Stone, come on. Come on, upgrade. It's currently level 2, isn't it? I think level 3 is... Oh no, level 3 is that, and then level 4 must be green. And I've actually seen there's white as well. I'm guessing that's the start of a metal one. So this is... Level 3 is a start of... Stone, I believe. So level 1, wood. Level 2, wood. Level 3... Stone, level 4, stone, level 5, metal, and probably level 6, metal. Okay, I wonder if you could make a wall out of bone. That would be kind of cool. A bit freaky, but cool. <laughs> How much stone have we actually got? Oh, we got loads. Open fire. Is it cooked? Cooked, yes. Extinguish fire. I'm getting better at cooking. There we go, there we go. Uh, eat and eat. Uh, open just so we actually have some light. Actually, we've got our lanterns, so we don't need it. Awesome. Six. I wonder if we can put it on air. Ah. Oh, that would be good if we could put it on air, but we have to put it like in the center then, I guess. Uh, open lantern. Do what do we need? Ignite. Do we need to put low grade fuel? I think we need to put low-grade fuel in there, which is alright, because it's actually really simple to make, isn't it? Animal fat and cloth, yes. And look at that, we can see our house now. Awesome! Uh, so we... Yes, I have already done the floor, good. I had to forget then, have I done the floor or not? Uh, level 3. I would really like just something to say, like, if you hit a wall it says level two or level three or whatever level it is currently. I'm not sure if the door actually upgrades differently to the door frame. I, th I think it does. Because I think that should be getting stone now. Yeah, stone and that requires wood. In fact, we can get wood out of here, open fire, take all of this wood, and lovely jubbly. Upgrade the door. Wood. Wood, wood, wood. I don't think the door has different models yet either, so I think it is like, stone door is just still a wooden door. How would you make a, a door out of stone? Well, that'd be kind of awkward to do, because of course it would be really heavy. But oh well. Come on, level 3. Awesome. Wait, was it level 3 I wanted to get to, or level 4 I wanted to get to? I think I wanted to level 4, isn't it? Yeah, level 4 and then level 5. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. <laughs> It'll be cool if there... You know how you craft things and it like has a little meter which goes along? Something something like that instead. Like, perhaps it says level 3 and then it has a little counter thing. And it goes up level 4. Awesome. Level this. Up to level 4. Also have to do the ceiling as well. At least it doesn't take ages and ages to upgrade it. Come on. Level upgrade. Upgrade. Come on. One thing I find a bit weird is how the health and stuff is in the right corner now. Because it was in the left corner before. And in Rust. Rust, Rust. The original Rust. I think it was in the left corner as well. And I just find it weird how it's not in the left corner anymore. Upgrade. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Let's see if it's actually using open. Huh. It's... I, I don't think that's actually using anything yet, which is cool. Upgrade. It would be perhaps nice to have like a second kind of hammer which you could have. 
fact, what else we can we craft whilst we're just hitting on this? Don't need, don't need, don't need. In fact, can we make any weapons yet? We can make an arrow. Don't really need an arrow. In fact, because I call saved some of this away. Ha ha! Ha ha! Come on, come on. That's my other key. Uh, we can actually make a hunting bow or... Well, I don't want that. We can make a hunting bow. Sweet. Wow, that went really fast. Oh, no, I don't have enough wood for the arrows. Oh. <laughs> well, that's annoying. Uh, let's put you back there. And start upgrading this again. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Upgrades to the future. Hmm. I wonder if there's actually anything after metal. There wasn't in the previous one. And I don't think there is. Which makes sense, because I don't think there actually is anything you can get. Also, I'm still not sure if it is actually, um... Ooh, what's... what's it? Oh, it's my foot on the floor. Um, I'm not sure if there are, like, structures generated in the world or anything. I think that would be cool to have. Still a little bit annoying that for windows and door frame, you can't actually see if there is anything up... Uh, like, if it's upgraded or not, until you just keep hitting on it, hitting on it, hitting on it. Come on. We'll get everything to level four? Three? Four? Three. And then we shall say goodnight. So, I'm guessing by the time I actually come back to this, my house is just going to be ransacked. And I'm probably going to be dead, which will be annoying. Uh, this is level three, is it already? I think this could be level two. We should get up to level three. Oh, we also have to do the ceiling as well. Oh. Come on, level three. Awesome. Get you up. Also, I, I am actually... Oh, that's level four. Awesome. I am purposely like putting these near the window just so that if anyone wants them, they can like reach through my window and get them. <laughs> I don't think the floor has a different model. The, that floor, that is. Not the like foundation floor. So this is stone. Level three. Awesome. At least I can't burn myself now as well. Did I... Did that upgrade? No, that was that one. I thought it said this upgraded as well, like instantly. There we go. And you. I would still really like a roof block. I really would. Would be so cool. And perhaps a ladder or something? Because then you can have like a little... Uh, like, attic in there. If, if that's possible, you could have a little attic. If it, it doesn't need to have, actually have like space to actually move around in it. You could, I would just love to have like a little roof block so I can have like a literally just a little cabin. It would be cool. Come on, nearly there. And you done? Uh, don't think I've done you though yet. So it'll be all level three. Halfway to in fact, no, not all level three. There's still that one wood wall here which isn't done. It's done, level three, and you. Yes. Yes, I think that's all. Yes. Still a little bit annoying, but you can't tell from, like, ceilings. Well, floors, even though it's my ceiling. Uh, yeah. Yeah, a little, little, little yellow house. Yeah, there's a white wall over there, so I'm guessing that's metal. Uh, that's kind of cool. He's got, like, a little extra walls around his house. Yeah. Perhaps I should do that. I haven't got anything in it, have I? No. Uh, yep. We shall just say goodnight. I'm feeling a little bit tired, so good night to everyone, even though it's the middle of the day. <laughs> just just pretend it's night. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this. Tell me if you want to see more, and we'll see you next time. Bye!